what I thought we would do, the three of us together, we are going to call a total stranger. And we are going to see if the three of us can take the impression of a playing card and send telepathically the image of that card to that total stranger and see if it creates an image in his or her mind and they're able to really come up with a card we thought of. So what we'll do, I'm gonna ask Sam, would you please tell me what value would you like of the card? Do you, anything from ace to king, you know, ace, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, all the way up to king, what value would you like? Let's go with Jack. Okay, Jack, perfect. And then now we've got to come up with the suit. So now I'm going to ask Madeline, do you have a suit in mind? Clubs, hearts, spades, diamonds. Do you have one that you would like? Yes. What would you like? Diamonds. Okay, very, very good. So what we are going to do now, I have my phone and you guys can see, we are gonna create a phone number. We're just gonna make one up, okay? So I'm going to, um, I will put in, um, or you guys can, let me ask, Madeline, if you'll give me three numbers right off the top, that'll be an area code. Five, four, eight. Very good. Five, four, eight, in it goes. And then, so you can see that's exactly what we're entering, what you say. And then Sam, how about the three number prefix? Seven, six, three. Seven, six, three. Got it. And then how about Madeline, four numbers for the last four digits of the phone number? Nine, zero, three, two. Three, two. Got it. We're going to dial it. Hey, y'all, you've reached Laura Joe. I'm not in right now. Leave a message and I'll call you back. Okay. That's a bust. So let's now call again. Let's see if we can get somebody to answer. Let's do, Sam, how about three numbers for an area code? Okay. Uh, 784. 784. And then a prefix for Madeline, any three numbers? Uh, 881. 8. Eight, one, and then Sam, two numbers. Two, three. Two, three, and then Madeline, two numbers. Uh, six, four. Okay, six, four. Here goes, gang. Let's see what we got. Can you hear it okay? Hello? Hello. <laughs> my name is Dave uh, Goldman. This is Amanda, who's this? Yeah, Amanda, my name is Dave Goldman. And I'm calling you out of the clear blue. There are three of us right now sending a mental impression to you of a- Wait, 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 what, who is this? My name is Dave Goldman. I'm sending you an impression of a playing card along with two others. We're trying- uh, Amanda. I, yes, Amanda, I understand. We're trying to send you an impression. We want you to tell us what you see in your mind. We're looking for a playing card, any Hi. playing card. <laughs> what? Yeah. We're sending you a mental image and, and let's see if this works. Let's see if you can tell us what mental uh, image. Yeah, no, I guess I, I guess I could do that. Okay. Okay. Yes. Please just kind of clear your mind and see what image you're getting. How are you doing? That, that's impossible. I, I can't even see the cards. I, that's exactly. That's the whole point. The image is going to come into your mind from us. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, I can do that. Okay, good. So clear your mind, see what image we're okay, sending. it can be any card? Any card. Uh, Jack of Diamonds. Well done. That's <laughs> it, it's Jack of Diamonds? It is, you are great. You, you are a wizard. How did I do that? You did it very well. Yeah. I'm a wizard. You are a wizard. And Amanda, we want to thank you so very much. That's for... so fun. That's so awesome. Well, you're awesome. Thank you for doing this with thank us. Thank you. Yes. You take care. Bye. Bye. Hmm. 
No way. <laughs> there we go. Now that shows the ability to take the power of the mind and even send thoughts to others. So let's capitalize on that and let's look at this rotation. We have a light bulb. And the light bulb represents the thought of learning. Learning is a light. And we want the light to go off in our heads. And so as we learn ideas, we get little sparks because little sparks is what learning is all about. And so little sparks come to us. And while this light bulb is unplugged right now, we can still get little sparks of energy. And that's the idea. If we're away doing a rotation and we're not at the school, we still pick up sparks of knowledge that came from being in the classroom. And so now what you all are seeing is you are able to take that knowledge and create energy to learn more and more on each rotation. And I hope this rotation has brought the light to you all so that you are able to kindle that light of knowledge. And you all have done such a great job. I appreciate you and all you all have done. And I wanna thank you both very, very much for making this a great week. Thank you. Thank you.